In this video, we will be covering how to enable EDR on your endpoint using XDR user interface. You can enable enhanced data collection via the agent setting profile. This can be done in the existing agent setting profile. However, you can also create new agent setting profile, which can then be applied to a limited set of endpoints. So let's see how we can achieve this. First, navigate to endpoint and then click policy management. In order to create a profile, we choose profiles under prevention and then click new profile. Here we need to fill in the required information about designated platform. In our case, it will be Windows and then click on agent setting and choose next. You will have to provide a profile name. So let's give it a name. And then we can jump straight to the configuration item uh, by clicking on XDR Pro Endpoint from the left side menu. Click Default, which is Disabled. Choose Enabled from the drop down option and then create a profile. Now, once the profile is created, we need to apply this profile to the policy rules. So let's navigate to the policy rules on the prevention and click on new policy. Let's fill in the blanks like the policy name. Select the platform Windows um, in our case and the agent setting profile that we created previously. Click on next. At this point, Cortex um, XDR will ask uh, to what endpoints we want to apply in this policy. So we will select a group of endpoints and click on next. After the step, we will see the summary of the actions that would be executed by uh, the Cortex XDR. In our case, creation of new policy, uh, which is targeted at these uh, limited endpoints which we selected, and applying the XDR profile. Press Done. And save the changes in order to apply the policy configuration. Click on Save. And the policy rules have been updated successfully.